Hello people, welcome back to my channel Salut les amis, bienvenue et bon retour sur ma chaîne Hola et bienvenue dans la Ami Canal Konnichiwa, what is your channel ni yokus As you can see by the title, we're gonna talk about some colors Red specifically Let's dive deep into what is actually so special about wearing red because we kind of have that mind or that idea when it comes to the red it doesn't have to be from head to toe it could be a pop of color, a pop of red here and there but at the end of the day we're just thinking about how we can dress up in order to feel beautiful, feel sexy and feel really attractive to partners or even better, a date so let's dive deep into it before getting any further, I'm a personal psych and I'm passionate about helping creative entrepreneurs uncover their authentic style so that they can show up better and 10 times confident in their lives and in their businesses taking things really and very personally so red has always been associated to something passionate to something sexy to something mysterious throughout the cultures even like my home country Cameroon in Europe it's the same thing North America the same thing Asia is the same thing when you see a man wearing red you're gonna find him more attractive and when men see women wearing red obviously they see it as being really attractive I don't remember how many universities but some of the women students were being asked to read pictures having men wearing red and other colors they were red, they were gray, they were blue if I remember strangely enough the men wearing red were seen as being the most attractive based on the results which shows how much we as women we even see a woman wearing red and seeing the sexiness when it comes to it you know Personally, I love a man wearing pink. I don't know why it is something with pink. Let me know if I'm the only one or let me know if I'm not the only one. I'll be really happy here. It seems to be the same thing for men wearing women. And some studies again showed here that when to the restaurant, they were most likely to give higher tips to waitresses wearing red. Red has always been associated to powerful men. Being really much more attractive in red because it symbolized the power all the higher powerful men were wearing red the cardinals, the kings, the judges kind of related and really subconscious but we've been trained to see it all the time so the brain associated the red to the power even in Rome back then all the leaders called Cochinati they were wearing red and for women red has been associated to fertility and sexuality for years and years and ages in Africa, my continent, have and um, kind of wear red operas for any type of ritual or celebration. Sexy, attractive, it wakes you up when it comes to the red. So, what you can do for it when it comes to everyday life? And I talked about it today just because it's Valentine's week, if I could say it like that. I know a couple of women, a couple of people, a couple of couples, and a couple of people planning to have their dates <laughs> similar way. When it comes to going in an online dating website, for example, or creating an account, think about the red as being something attractive and sexy for you. So wear some type of red. If you're not a fan of pop colors, again, because I know not everybody is a fan of it, it'd be overwhelming for people wearing neutrals and or not being used to wear so much warmer or intense colors. That's all fine. It's something black along with something red. I mean, the combination to me is just powerful to a date. It could go easier on you if you don't want to have to have a bigger red piece. The other thing you can do is to use a profile picture with red background. And it's gonna come and complement your skin tone. Men or the woman is gonna feel like, ooh, there's something interesting, there's something sexy, there's something sensual about her as it is somewhere in the background wherever you are. So if you need to have a date somewhere, it's mysterious, sexy vibe. Think about those places. Using the color psychology behind it, using it in a way to feel beautiful. I always say it's not about the clothes, it's how you want to feel yourself and how you want to make people feel about you. Another great combination that I have, especially if you have a warm undertone, is the red, the black, and the gold. Gold accent, gold jewelry. Ugh, ugh. Do I have something to say? To you, how you want to mix it up. Wearing a red top, 
depending of the shade could be really beautiful because it's gonna bring some natural glow to your skin tone no all those tactics all those tips and all the psychology behind wearing red it's not gonna do anything if you want something long term and it's not gonna do anything to your personality because if you go to a date let's say it's a potential you like him he likes you the vibe is good I mean when it comes to you clicking it's all gonna be about how you see yourself in front of him and I'm gonna talk about it more in my second video of the week what is it to be sexy what is it to feel sexy how to dress sexy because we hear sexy as a word that has a lot of interpretations Different cultures have different ways of saying it so I'm gonna dive deep into that and how you can dress up sexy for your own look for your own authentic style I'm gonna be a little bit more of the psychology behind it rather than anything else start with you who you are what you like about yourself and how you want to showcase that part of you to the world if you want to know more you know what to do subscribe to the channel it's gonna be interesting 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 i've been so used to this channel so i'm back probably gonna add the other videos that i had on my other channel so this one is gonna be a little bit of a mix match between some videos that i already did and videos that i'm gonna make so get ready for it it's gonna be more videos at least for the month and then after that we'll see i hope you like it let me know what's your plan for valentine's day i'm gonna talk to you more on my next video and until then smile because it's free and contagious bye